If I told you that the fastest way to make sales on TikTok shop or really anywhere at the moment isn't by guessing or reinventing the wheel, but by simply studying what's already working, you'd probably think, well, yeah, that makes sense. And of course you would be right. Imagine trying to climb the Empire State Building. Would you rather start at the ground floor or the 80th? What if I told you that there was a tool that would let you skip all the guesswork and start on that 80th floor with content that is already proven to work? And that is exactly what I'm gonna show you here in a second with gethook.ai. It is one of the best tools that I've found to consistently create content that performs across platforms, whether it's TikTok shop, affiliate videos, paid ads, you name it. And that's by using this to model what's already working for other brands other similar products and going off of that, starting on that metaphorical 80th floor. Now, before we get into the video, if you do wanna try gethook.ai, you can do so through the link in the description below and you can save 30% by using the code Brian30. So as you can see, just signing in here, there is a ton of opportunity here. They have over 22 million ads here and they're uploading more every single day, it seems. There are a ton of filters, just like any other product research software that I've used in the past, but there are a ton of use cases for this. So for example, let's say you were doing a certain niche product, or you were thinking about launching a product on TikTok shop, for example. Let's say you were launching protein, or maybe you wanna be an affiliate for protein, so we could search for the keyword protein, and that's gonna yield us a ton of different results from other brands, other creators, running ads, and making successful creatives around protein, okay? So as we come down here, you can see all the different ads that are currently running based off that specific protein, right? But if you wanted to narrow it down, as you can see here, there are certain filters for these specific ads, right? So this one right here is a one star. It's in the early stage of developing performance data. It's only been running for a short period of time. And you can see that it's only been running for two days. Same thing with this one. It's a one star. It's only been running for one day. And again, it'll literally tell you this is in the early stage of gathering initial performance data. So rather than sort through all of these videos, what we wanna do is use the search filters on the side to come up with better ads so that we're only seeing the top performing ones so that we can utilize them and replicate them to make winning creatives for our brand or our product or whatever it is that we wanna launch, right? So you can filter on the side by stars by simply clicking down on performance. And then as you can see here, you can select four stars, five stars, or a combination of a, of a bunch of different ones. So let's just select the top ones here. And just off the top of the bat, you can see now it's only going to show us five-star ads around protein. And by just hovering over these, you can see this is exceptional. It's driving maximum results. This one was launched 16 days ago. And this specific brand has 628 current ad creatives running, okay? And it's also gonna obviously tell you the brand and show you the creative, show you the call to action, show you the landing page, the specific offer, whether that creative is a video or a picture. And then from there, you can see based off all of that data, what is working for other similar brands, right? Same thing with this one. It's got an exceptional rating here. It's driving a ton of sales. It was launched 15 days ago on June 2nd. But let's say hypothetically, because as you can see, we're scrolling down here, a lot of these are picture ads, right? So maybe this brand is running them on Facebook, for instance, right? But maybe we wanna launch a TikTok shop product. So what we wanna do is we wanna scroll down and again, filter it for ad format, right? So we're not gonna go image, we're not gonna go carousel, we're gonna filter it for videos. And now it's only gonna show us five-star great ads that are videos so that we can then utilize that as inspiration to make ours. And I always say that the best way to start when you're just starting to get initial sales is not necessarily by copying, right? People always get up in arms when I say that term. Don't copy, right? But what you do wanna do is you do wanna utilize what's already working and start there, right? So that doesn't mean copy their, like this is 34 seconds. That doesn't mean copy 34 seconds of this video word for word and exactly the way that they made it by their same creative and like film the same exact shots. But what it does mean is this is working. So we wanna utilize maybe their hook and test that out, but then add a different part of the video to make it our own afterward. Or maybe they're coming from a certain angle that works better for this specific protein and so we can utilize that in our video this is going to not only give us inspiration and show us what's working but it's also going to allow us to see what the hook is what the creative is and we can also just save this if you see by clicking save here and what that's going to do is it's going to add it to our swipe file over here so that we don't just have to 
take these ads down one by one. If we're going through for protein, we can just add a bunch to our swipe file and then check them all out later by going to swipe file here and then they'll all be stored right here. So just to show you some of this. Intake, Lea Diet Whey Protein is the perfect solution for those who prefer a refreshing juice-like shake. I'm personally not a huge fan of creamy protein shakes, especially not in the summer. But luckily, it'll also show you the specific copy for the ad, so ditch the creamy shakes. Say hello to Clear Diet Whey, a refreshing juice-like shake with four fruity flavors, zero sugar, zero fat. Same thing with this one. You can watch this one. You can also download the specific video and then utilize their script. Again, don't copy word for word, but you can utilize their hook, make the script into your own, and then run a similar ad, make a similar video because you know that that's already proven to work. Now, one other thing that you'd wanna take into consideration here is filtering on the side for runtime. This is the best way, in my opinion, to combine all of these factors and find winning creatives and winning videos that you can replicate that are gonna get you the best results, right? So the reason that runtime is important, I'm gonna put 30 days here, you could put 60 if you wanted. The reason that that's important is because nobody's gonna to continue to run ads to a product video that isn't converting. They're not gonna to continue to waste their money. And so if they're running it for a certain extended period of time, let's even go 60 days here and see what pops up. If they're running this for 70 days, 71 days, you can bet your bottom dollar that this is converting and driving sales because nobody's gonna continue to waste money for an extended period of time on something that isn't driving a positive ROI, okay? So that's the other filter that you'd wanna add, runtime. Obviously filter it for your ad format. And then I like to obviously stick with the five stars so that you know that it's driving a ton of different ratings. And that's one of the easiest ways that you can obviously search via keyword if that's what you're specifically looking for. And then again, you just come down in here, you can save that and add it to your swipe file on the right. You can look at the ad details by clicking in, generate the AI script, which is basically gonna come up with a similar script for you. You can generate the transcript of this specific video, which is a game changer. So you don't have to like, you know, I what I used to teach like, uh, I think it was like six months ago, I used to teach to play the video and then like have it dictate on Word so that you could get the video script. You don't have to do that anymore. They literally let you download the transcript, which is a game changer. But let's say that, for example, you are launching a protein on TikTok shop or you're launching a protein on your Shopify store and you wanna know what other successful brands or maybe you even have your eye on a successful brand that you wanna emulate and copy and start to compete with, right? Well, what you can do is you can go into Brand Spy here. So let's say hypothetically you wanted to spy on Protein Works, we can come into Brand Spy, and now we just type whatever brand that we wanna actually spy on, that we wanna learn a ton about, and that we wanna emulate into the actual search bar here. So this would be Protein Works and see what pops up. And now within Brand Spy, we can actually see all the information about this brand, right? We can see the, how many formats of each they're running. They're running 71 total image ads, which is only 1.7 of their total ads. They're running 518 video ads, which is only 12.45% of their video ad, of their ads overall, excuse me. And they're running 3,500, it looks like almost 3,600 carousel ads, right? So there might be something to that. And again, this is important data because if we're, for example, running a Shopify store or you know we wanna start launching an ad on TikTok, well, we might wanna look into carousels because clearly if they're running a ton of ads and they're running 85, almost 86% of their ad budget is allocated towards carousels, probably because that's working the best for them, right? Same thing with their trends. You can look at the trend chart. You can use their, mo this. and this section right here is hands down my favorite part of this. You can look at their most used hooks, which obviously that is crucial information that's gonna shortcut it for you. So you don't just have to go ad by ad, you can literally look down the list and look at all their most successful hooks and even generate hooks based off that with the AI here. So if we click into get all, so if we click into view all here, you can see these overnight oats have 20 grams of protein and are so easy to make. And we can see with all the specific different videos that are using that hook. Now, if we click generate hooks, that's gonna allow us to use AI to come up with similar hooks for us so that we can come up with a similar hook that might have similar results, but isn't the same exact one, right? So that's another valuable tool as well. And one more thing that's really cool is you can see their most used landing pages, right? Why is that important? Because a lot of times different companies and different brands will test different landing pages to see which one works, which one converts the best. And so we can then utilize that information for our website, for our brand or for our product, right? So if we click on this one, they're running 22%, almost 23% of their ads are going to this specific page right here. 
which is the, the two week weight loss pack. Now, why is that important? Obviously, if you're running a Shopify store, you can create a similar landing page to this. That's extremely valuable. But if not, what you can utilize is if something on this page is converting better for them, we can utilize that copy and that information and speak to our customer in a similar way, right? So maybe we wanna say like, or start your weight loss journey today with our two week weight loss pack only $30 for 23 calorie control meals and a free shaker bottle, right? Like I, you'd come up with something similar, not exactly the same, but you get the picture, right? And so all of this data, all of this insight is extremely valuable, whether you're spying a brand and looking for emulating what someone else is doing just overall, or if you're looking for a specific product, again, you can go back into explore and type in keywords to find successful ads, utilize the filters, set it for a specific time period so that you know that they're running that ad over an extended period of time, set it for the rating so that you know that it's a good quality ad and it's getting a lot of sales and driving a lot of conversions. You don't wanna filter it for obviously one stars or two stars, you wanna go straight to the five stars, for long run time. And then you can also sort, and then you can also filter it for ad creative, right? So whether you wanna go after carousels, like this one right here, or video ads if you're doing it on TikTok or something like that, that's all valuable insight that you can utilize. And again, you can sort and filter through this. This is an incredible product research tool. So the moral of the story is if you wanna start creating content that actually gets attention and drives real sales fast, this is honestly one of the best tools that I found. And you can try it out, like I said before, through the link in the description below and save 30% off with the code Brian30. And whether you're brand new completely or you're trying to get better results with your current brand, your current store, and your current products with less guesswork, this can be a serious shortcut for you. It helps you skip the trial and error phase, study what's working and literally see all the data and hit the ground running with content that's already proven to convert based off real time data. So you can get results, not 30 days from now, 60 days from now, and not mediocre results. You can get the best results possible in the shortest time period possible. Okay. But as always, this is just what works for me. So I really hope it helps.